everyone chris marty from how to fight aka the rebate guy always remember that we will save you thousands of dollars on any new home construction purchase from any builder in the state of texas with our rebate program so if you're looking for a great agent that knows what's going on and is going to save you a lot of money make sure you reach out as always guys we're here to take you through perry homes one of the most popular builders that we work with here on this channel great product great builder and this plan is the 2332w series it is in their 40 foot collection of homes meaning it's again on that 45 to 50 foot lot size there uh giving you a really really nice exterior here brick and stone options and of course different elevations depending on where you build it so let's head inside and see what this home has to offer Okay, so right as we head inside, guys, this space is going to typically be your garage, right? So that's your drop zone right there. And there's going to be a wall there to head into the garage with a door that's located right on the other side of that. So that's what that is going to be. They're using it as office space right now because it is a model home. But you do have a full half bath right here located right when you come into the home. I like the way that this elevation uses the window light there where they've got that three triple windows there. You can see Perry has different options for flooring. They have different pedestal sink options. They have a bunch of different things at their design center. So lots of choices when you're looking to build a home with them. And the huge front door, again, you guys have options there when you go to the design center to choose multi-panel doors. So a lot of different flexibility upgrades and options here when you're building with Perry. So right when we turn around, this plan is really cool because the living space is truly like almost right off the front door. Typically living rooms are maybe a little bit further back. So it's nice that you've got this huge vaulted ceiling, right? This is probably over 15, 16 feet of ceiling here in this huge great room. They've got that big fan up there with the down rod, right? Keeping it nice and cool in this Texas heat. And of course, windows everywhere. Windows is Perry's calling card. They put them everywhere. And you've got that nice flex space right there as well, located just off of the main living room great work from home office option or something like that you guys have a huge wall here as well to hang your tvs so this is actually a pretty big tv and that's how big this wall is as it makes it look not so big but truly you could easily put a 100 inch tv here and have that really really nice uh, great room right here so coming in now to that flex space to that office you can kind of see that they did some nice lighting options in here they got rid of that kind of center light right there and did the recessed can lights that's a great option at the design center as well and then they really just decorated it well for their model here, different shelves and things like that. Again, that's your stuff aftermarket, but you can see the wood tile here. Perry has really shifted to that in recent years. Most of their homes have wood look tile in them right now as kind of like a standard option. And those huge uh, non-functional windows, right? You cannot open those, those big, you know, six foot tall windows, but they are great for natural light. This Notice that this plan has no blinds, guys. You actually do have the ability to put blinds on these windows with the builder if you're looking for that. They just chose to accessorize with curtains for the model and keep these windows open. This right here is your breakfast area. So again, big, nice breakfast area here or dining area if that's what you want to use it for as your primary dining table area. They have that spot right here located right off the kitchen. Notice the cabinets, right? Two-tone cabinets. You have the ability with Perry Homes to do island one cover and the outer cabinets another color you actually can do three if you want have uh, different uppers lowers and the island cabinets be a different color they did nice built-in appliances here nice lighting fixtures tons of lights recessed can lighting in here beautiful quartz countertops with that single basin sink and of course that built-in range right there in the back you can get a little peek there and see what that's looking like so they did a really nice accessorized option tons of different backsplash options as well and if you didn't want the built-in appliances, they do have a slide-in range option if that's something that you're looking for. Rather than having the built-in uh, microwave and stove combo over there, you'll get some extra cabinet space back and then just keep the microwave. So pretty neat option there. Uh, a lot of people ask about fridges. All fridges do fit in these sizes, even if it doesn't make sense, unless they're like the really, really big oversized ones. That is a standard uh, depth fridge cut out there. So it fits the big Sony and LG and Samsung fridges that they have. So lots of different options in there. So as we head right here, we're heading back again into that dining space just to give you one last look at this really good use of space in the kitchen, in the primary living area, of course, and just the nice upgrades and finish out that Perry did in this model. So really, really good job, guys. And as we kind of come back here, you'll see again that back door there down to the covered patio outside, different patio options available. So check with your design center there. And this is your utility room at a nice location located right in the back. So if you're watching TV in the living space, it's not making too much noise because it's located to the rear of the home and they've got some nice shelves and things like that for your washer and dryer. And then this back here is actually going to be your primary suite 
You've got a little bit of a closet right here, kind of like a hall closet, linen closet, whatever you want to call it, right before you head into the primary suite with some nice shelf options as well for storage. And then once you come in here, you'll see they put the carpet in this one. Again, if that's not something you're looking for, you have full tile options. They got beautiful high ceilings in here. They did the nice kind of uh, accessorized wood wall back there, right? So you've got a lot of options in lighting fixtures and fans and just making this room truly your own, but really nice ceilings. They've got that dual ventilation there as well to keep this room cool. And then they do have functional windows here in the primary. So these windows do open um, for safety, right? In case there's an emergency and you need to get out of your home, but still tons of natural bright light. And they've got that nice double door set up here leading into that primary bath suite here as well. And you have a ton of room over here for storage and extra furniture. If you're looking to have some nice big pieces, hang your TV up on that wall, this primary suite allows for that. So really neat use of space here with Perry Homes. And again, heading into that primary. So this one's cool. It's got that kind of offset shower in the corner. And this one's mud set. So you see that little drop down with that tile there. And this one has a separate vanity. So you've got one on one side, one on the other. Great use of space. Everyone kind of gets their own side and can have their own things there without having to share a single unit. So this is a really neat bath space there as well. This one has the fogged window. Yes, it does work. You cannot see through it. I have one of these in my Perry Homes. So really nice options as well. They did some upgraded fixtures there in the primary shower. And you can see they did also did the floor to ceiling tile option along with the mud set here at the bottom. And then as you kind of go this way and you open this door, you'll see that they actually have a nice little linen closet here as well. So remember you had that big one already when you came in and then now they've got this secondary linen closet here as well for your primary bath towels. Water closet with the door becoming more and more rare. Uh, a lot of builders are going away from this. So nice to still see it here with Perry Homes. And then as you head back here, this is gonna be your primary closet. So you'll see that here as we open this door huge primary closet right here ready to go for all of your clothes needs and that little white box back there people ask about that that does come with the homes it's kind of like an on cue panel is what they used to be called it's really where all your data drops your internet and cable and everything goes into your closet into that white box and then they've got some nice shoe racks here and of course the builder grade closet where you can hang all of your items so a nice size closet here for the perry homes as you are kind of looking here this is the nice flooring that they did in the primary suite lots of different options if you want wood tile if you want laminate if you want the more square ceramic tile there's lots of different options to choose from and on the shower walls as well so that wraps up the primary suite we are heading back into this beautiful living in kitchen area over here again passing that utility room passing our back patio that's that big pantry we didn't really go in there but it's again nice size pantry for this home and then as we are coming here we are heading upstairs note that outside for the office and the flex space on the left there is no secondary bedroom down on this plan. So all the rest of the bedrooms are upstairs on that one. You also have another under the stairs closet here as well. So closet, right? Less of a linen closet, but good use of space if you want to hang or, or store some bigger items there. So as you're heading up the stairs, lots of options on the stairs here, guys. If you want to do a half wall, they can do that. If you want to do these metal spindle railings, you can do that as well. All of these are options at the design center. But of course, doing the metal spindles makes it really, really elegant. And this is a really nice kind of flex open game room space that's up here. Use it for whatever you want. Hanging your TV here, your pool table, fool's ball table, or anything like that. Lots of nice options here on this secondary room with that attic access. That's what that little door is up there as well. And they did some nice recess lighting here. And this is kind of your hub with the access to the bedrooms. So here you'll see bedroom number two in this plan located right off that flex space upstairs. Really nice, good size, big window, a lot of natural bright light there, accessible to get in and out of the house if you needed. And of course that closet here in the corner. So good size secondary closets on this one. That's rare, as you know, especially with upper rooms. This one actually is truly like a walk-in closet for secondary bedrooms. So pretty nice option there to have a little bit more space for whoever is occupying this room on this plan. Nice big ceilings as well. Sometimes on secondary levels, the ceilings are a little bit smaller. So this was nice to just give it, again, big, elegant, high ceilings, truly from the first floor to the second floor. Again, lots of windows. And so now we're heading over here, and this is the third bedroom. So this is your bedroom number three right here. Secondary bedroom upstairs, again, with that big window, natural bright light, super bright in here. 
and then you've got a ton of space if you're looking for furniture you want to hang tvs same thing with that walk-in closet right here really really good size for a secondary bedroom so this really gives you a lot of space up here for the secondary bedroom uh, on the closet space so really nice good use of space here and if you want to upgrade that you know aftermarket you can do that and so as we head back outside we're passing that bath right now same thing if you want to do a walk-in shower here you could right maybe you don't need a bathtub and or you want the floor to ceiling tile on the bath you can do that that's an option at the design center change out the way the secondary vanity looks change the countertop material tons of different options here and then you can kind of just see as we look out over to the great room you have that wall of windows right there you got that big upper level and lower level and with the wrought iron railing you've got that access there to down below so as we head outside guys the patio again is different right depending on where you build this what the elevation is there's some different options on the patio here this is the one that they did for this home and it can be extended with some options as long as the lot fits on it that's of course going to be a requirement due to the hoa and the building lines a really nice covered patio here a lot of those accessible night bright windows there and of course plenty of room for your fan and your patio furniture to give you all that space for outdoor entertaining so of course every one of these is going to be different depending on the lot and the fit and things of that nature but this has been the tour of the 2332w guys we are so excited to have been out here and show you this plan and as always if you're looking to buy new home construction with the rebate guy please make sure you reach out any neighborhood any city in texas we can help you and we will save you thousands of dollars with our buyer rebate program on any of these homes anywhere and please like and subscribe and follow our channel for more amazing content where we're going to take you through all the different builders in this area and highlight their best-selling floor plans and why you need to build one of these for your household we'll catch you next time